So here's what we're working with. Just about done building it. Uh, before I put the lid on it, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, put the LEDs in and do a little bit of electrical work. But yeah, this is how far we are. Here's the LEDs. It's a little strip. It's a six and a half footer. But I'm only gonna use three feet because I don't need six feet. Yep. I'm gonna stain it probably, but not right now. All right, let's open this thing up. Got the packet. Got a remote with lots of functions. We'll look at that in a minute. And there's our roll. Of lights. Five volt, of course. USB. Ta da! You know what I like about this thing? You don't even have to be in vision of the sensor, you just have to be within about six feet. I'll speed this up times four. And a half. Oh yeah, that stain was a uh, <clears throat> coffee. I caulked the glass with some uh, bathtub and tile caulking. It seems to be pretty airtight. And there's the hole for the terminal. Yeah, it's peel and stick, but it doesn't like to stick to that caulking. So I had to glue it to the wood. I don't think I shared that part. It's self-adhesive. It's pretty good with the wood. So here's what the house USB plug. It's pretty cool. But I'm gonna obviously have it in a car. So I'm gonna have to take this thing apart. That's the positive on the tip. And I'm gonna run it off my amp. So I'll save you the nasty parts. This thing's got a little reducer on it that I need. So I'm gonna go ahead and crimp it. Make a little adapter of my own. Come on. There you go. Yes, I smashed my thumb the other day. I love when that happens. Too much copper in this thing. A little heat shrink so that the negative doesn't touch the positive that's within a quarter inch away. Take the torch to it. A little bit on my thumb and crimp the end. Now this positive spring, it's really on there, so I didn't even have to take it off. I just made it part of the family. Pretty cool. It was a pretty pretty compliant little thing. Give it a, good, a couple good smashes. See? Mm. 
I know I kind of overdid it with the wire. I think it's a uh, 10 gauge. But hey, some things you just don't have to. I'm gonna run this all the way to the end of the spring. Because these guys are way too close. Even though it's only 5 volts still. I need to catch my box on fire. Right. Zip tie just one one end of it. I know I need new pliers. So I was gonna glue it, but then I of course thought of that. And I don't know why I used the speed square. This is my form of quick release. Yup. Time to hook it up and try it out, right? It's running directly off the amp, which is directly off the battery. Pretty cool, huh? I was going to paint the inside white, but I kind of like this, the, the green, how it looks. Doesn't that look cool? Yes. I'm gonna move it. I think I wanna move it and put it on the back of the glass so that you can't see it when you look in. Let me know if uh, if you think that's a good idea or if I should put it where it's at. Well, thanks for watching everyone. If you can, please leave a like and subscribe. It'll help my channel. And let me know if you want anything else built or modified and I'll see what I can do. Talk to you later.